Hey everybody, Andrew Howard with Must Have Outdoors here today to talk about two new turkey decoys from Hunter Specialty. This, this is the Jake and Susie Snood. These are full body collapsible turkey decoys. As you can see, they have a real nice paint scheme to them. Looks like uh, real feathers and the paint is also flake free. I did have a little bit of wear and tear after using these one season, but it's you know, hardly noticeable. And two, I can't really you know run my finger over it and get any more paint off, uh, so that's nice too. The decoys fill up with a air valve at the bottom. Now one thing to note, this is not, these decoys were not designed to hold air. The air valve is simply so you can just get some shape to the decoy. Now when you get these from Hunter Specialties, they'll be folded up, they'll have some wrinkles and that you'll need to get out. And what I did was I just filled it up with air as best I could, set them out in the sun for an afternoon and they um, you know, expanded and got their kind of full body shape. Also when you store them, make sure you just store them uh, as they are now out, don't store them folded up. But when it comes time to fold them up, all you have to do is release this air valve, push the air out of it, and fold it up like you would a regular decoy. With the two of them together will fit in the turkey vest, but it is a little tight. Uh, the hen head position you can see is upright, and the Jake is in a kind of semi-aggressive pose, which uh, I think works well too. You know, it's just kind of your preference of how you like the hen head position. But uh, this past turkey season, my dad and I uh, both shot a turkey opening day using these decoys and uh, they worked well for us. One thing that was pretty cool to see the turkey my dad killed, he, once he saw this Jake decoy he came trucking in and uh, it was a done deal in just a matter of seconds. Another cool feature about these turkey decoys is the stake I how special these provides. It's a two position stake. So say you want the hen in a little bit more of a kind of breeding pose, you fold the stake in half, stick it back in the ground and put the hen back on back on the stake. That puts her a little bit lower to the ground. Uh, obviously when you set it up you want the hen in front of the Jake decoy when you do that, but it uh, allows you to kind of change your setup if you want to. One more thing to note about the stake, it has this rubber ring on it, so this will help you uh, kind of keep the decoy from swinging around if you're hunting in some uh, windy weather. So basically just make sure that the O-ring goes up inside the decoy, that'll help it prevent it from spinning around too much. But uh, these these are really nice looking decoys. Uh, they're collapsible, very lightweight, and they worked well for my dad and I this past turkey season. So i um, looking forward to put them to use in the future. As far as price goes, Hunter Specialties lists the Jake decoy for about $92 on the website, and the hen is about $74. So pretty, you know, pretty good price point for, I think, the quality of paint that you get. Uh, out of these decoys and the, the features as well. It's got some nice added features to it as well. And make sure to stay tuned to the end of this video. I have more product videos coming up next. And if you would, please check out the Must Have Outdoors Facebook page, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and sign up for the Monday morning Must Have newsletter where we send out a weekly product video on hunting gear. Do shot deformation. The resin kind of protects, I guess, the, the pellets. It keeps them from deforming. You know, when the shot's